Hi you guys, welcome back to a new vlog on the channel. I'm starting this vlog pretty early today. I'm vlogging a little bit earlier than I usually do. It's like 8.30 in the morning. I wanted to get a head start on my day because I have a lot of work to catch up on. Hopefully my camera angle is like not bad. Does it make me look like a plum? I need to figure out my like sitting at my desk tripod situation because I feel like it's not good. Let's see if this makes it better. Okay, that is much better. Okay, yes, so I'm currently um, answering emails. I'm having some breakfast. I made some oatmeal. I haven't had oatmeal for breakfast in forever. And it just kind of like reminds me of, I don't know, it's, oatmeal is just very comforting to me. It reminds me of like going to school in the fall. So um, I purchased, this is, um, this is the maple and brown sugar oatmeal. So I'm having some oatmeal for breakfast, iced coffee. I have a lot, a lot of emails to catch up on. I've been really bad at replying to emails and inquiries in general. So I'm gonna do that and I have a to-do list to-do list is on my phone I've also been starting to reuse my planner a lot more I've been bad at using my planner like the past few months um, but I've started using it recently and I wrote down what I need to do for the week so I need to go through that today today is Wednesday happy hump day everyone um, and I also have a few packages I wanted to show you guys. I'll show that in a minute. But yeah, so today is going to be kind of like a chill, like run errands with me, kind of work with me type of video. This week has been all over the place. I like don't even plan my weeks out anymore because stuff always like comes up. And I try to like put a schedule together for myself for the work week. But I stick to like 50% of it and the other, the other 50% I just, I stick to like 50% of my schedule and the other 50% kind of just like gets pushed or canceled. <laughs> so yeah, I also am hoping to the pool today because it's been forever since I've been to the pool. That's why I got up early, earlier than usual. I usually start working around like 10 o'clock. Like I'll use from like 9 o'clock to 10 o'clock to like do my like morning routine, like eat breakfast, clean, get ready, work out. Um, but I wanted to just like start working at 8.30 so I could finish and go to the pool today. Hopefully. Let me check the weather because it has been raining like every other day here in Maryland. Today is going to be, oh, it's going to rain at 4 p.m., 80% chance. So uh, hopefully I can make it to the pool before then. If not, no big deal. Me and my friend Ida, who you guys have seen in the vlog before, she um, and I are planning a pool day on Friday. So I think I'll vlog that too. That'll be fun. She's fun in my vlog. So okay. mm. I'm going to finish working and um, I will check in with you guys when I'm done. a kid growing up and my grandma she used to come visit because my my grandparents um they're from minnesota and so um growing up in maryland my grand my dad's parents they used to always like come visit us my grandma specifically she would come like twice a year and i loved her so every time she would come visit and um it was always like when i was a kid and i had to get up and go to school she would come like during the school year and I remember I'd wake up in the morning and I was ne I was never a morning person, even as a kid, never, ever, ever a morning person, still not a morning person. That's just how I've been my whole life. But I used to wake up in the mornings and just be so tired. And my grandma, she like would tell me to stretch and we do, we would do these stretches together while I was still in bed to like help wake me up. So now every morning in my bed, I sit up and I do my stretches. I forgot that I have some packages to show you guys. And I got a lot of things for my desk because as you guys know, I've talked about it in pretty much every vlog. I just like redid my whole office and I cleaned and organized my like desk space, got a new desk and all that. So I really wanted to get more like desk accessories that would help me um, be more productive and organized and just make my desk a lot cuter and make me more excited to sit here. So I picked up a lot of office supplies. I also picked up a notebook. I've been needing a new like notebook, just a plain one, just I can write in and write all my notes in. 
I'm very old fashioned. While I still like to use my computer and my phone to like record notes, I like to write everything down on paper. So um, I bought a new note notebook from Erin Condren. I've gotten a planner from from them before. I really like their their brand. Like my planner that I used to have from them, I loved it so much. It was such a great way to organize. And um, I really wanted to get a notebook. And I really, I'm just so crazy. Like I wanted a really pretty one. I know I could have just gotten a $5 one from Target or Amazon, but I wanted a really nice one that would make me feel all cute and all when I would write. So I got a personalized one from Ann Condren and um, it's coming in like a few weeks because they have to personalize it. It takes a while for their stuff to get here. So um, that's coming, but I ordered some other stuff on Amazon and oh wow, perfect timing because I have other boxes to open, but I got some box openers because I needed something other than scissors to open up my packages. And then the next thing I got is this menu pad. So a few vlogs back, I talked about how I'm trying to plan my menus out for the week a lot better. And what I had been using was this planner from Papier and um, it had a meal planner, a menu planner in it. And I really like that feature. I don't use the rest of the planner aside from that section. So I figured instead of just like using this whole book, I can just get a plain old menu pad on the menu. It has magnetic strips in the back. You can hang it on the fridge. And I think, oh yeah, you can rip out the shopping list. So basically um, it goes Monday through Sunday. Here you can write down what you want to eat each day for dinner. And you can write here a shopping list, like what you need for said meals. So I love this whole setup. That's exactly what I've been doing in this planner. But instead of having a whole book, I kind of just wanted just the just the menu like section part of it. And I like how I can put on my fridge so I can like see what I'm eating for the week. And also I like how I can rip out the shopping list so I can bring it with me to the store. So I got that. That's not really an office supply, but I've been wanting to get something like that for a while. So that's all that's in that box. I have another box from Amazon. I need to open these so I can open the rest of my packages. We got it, okay. Wow, so much better than a scissors. Okay, just a couple random office supplies. I feel like I ordered more. Oh no, so I was gonna get gel pens from Amazon too. Cause every time I write in my planner or take notes, I love writing in color cause visually it helps me see the notes better and absorb it better that's always how i've been ever since like i was like in high school and college i always had to write in colors so i got gel pens also from aaron condren so the notebook and the gel pens are going to come in a couple weeks but for now i got these really pretty highlighters so pretty highlighters are my fascination it is back to school time even though i am not in school anymore but Let's pretend. Okay, I'm gonna actually open up the next thing I got, which are white post-it notes because I wanted to keep with my white theme going on. I am crazy, I know. But I also just needed new post-it notes. So I wanna swatch, like it's makeup. I wanna um, swatch each of these so you can see the color. The brown one, it's very unfortunate. It's kind of dried out. It still works, but not as well as the others. I guess that's what I get from ordering from like, you know, this type of company, but. They're such pretty colors. The rest of them are. So um, that's all I got from Amazon. Look how nice that looks. I did have a couple of other like highlighters here that are the normal bright, bright colors. But so nice. Aesthetics. Oh, so another thing I got from Amazon that I'm not sure if I showed on the blog yet. I got this Apple Watch wristband replacement. And it's like a gold. Yeah, you can see. It's like a gold link chain. And I saw Claire Pierce. She's really big on TikTok. She's also from the DC area, I just found out. But I love her TikToks. She's awesome, check her out. But she um, posted this on her page, so I got inspo from her. But I think it's so gorge. I love how it looks with all of my gold bracelets. Okay, I have a couple more packages to show. This one is from Zara Home. I really love Zara Home, by the way. If you haven't shopped from them before, they have really, really cute home decor stuff they have everything they have like bedding stuff for your bathroom the kitchen so i got a couple of kitchenware stuff i got this ribbed glass i saw someone on instagram i forgot who it was it was just on my explore page but i saw someone with this glass they were i'm um, drinking iced coffee out of it it's like a ribbed glass i was expecting it to be a little bit more thicker but it's actually very thin i just thought it was so cute it would be so nice for my iced coffee or even water whatever i opened this box already and i looked at this i was not expecting this to be this small i thought this was going to be the size of like an actual mug but it's just this little like what would you call this like a saucer no the saucer is this it came with a saucer it's like this little set 
I thought that was cute. Maybe for like my teas or my, oh, my espresso. That's what it's, yeah, that's what it's probably for. Not really a home thing. Um, it's like a toiletry bag. I have kind of been needing a new one. I have like a makeup bag and all that, but one for my toiletries, that's not that huge black expansive thing that I've shown in vlogs before. I just wanted like a simple one that I can bring like in my weekender bag. And I really like the white linen design of this. The inside actually is not lined, which I didn't know. So I'm gonna have to be really careful not to spill stuff in here. I'll find something to use it for, but I just thought it was so pretty. And one last package is from Abercrombie. They had a sale a couple weeks ago. Everything was like 25% off. Every time they have their sale, which they do pretty often, but every time they have a sale, I try to pick up some jeans because those are literally the only jeans that fit me, their Curve Love line. I believe this one is just their 90s, 90s straight ultra high rise Curve Love. I have so many in the style, but I wanted a more darker shade, like darker wash of the jeans. So this one also has a really cute like cross design up here and it is just straight leg. It also has no rips. A lot of the Abercrombie jeans I have have rips. So I just wanted a plain pair that were a little bit medium to darkish wash with no rips. I am addicted to white button up shirts. So I got another one and this is supposed to be oversized Fit. It's just your average plain white button up. The quality seems really nice though, at least. The last thing I got is this tube top. This is like $18. I've been just wanting a white like tube top. So yeah, that's all that I have to show you guys today. So I'm gonna clean up, finish working, and then I need to go right out to FedEx. I also need to go to the post office. We have a lot of like little shipping errands to run today. So I did all my package drop off. So I went to FedEx and the post office. I stopped by CVS because I needed to pick up a couple things and every time I go into some type of drugstore I go for one or two things and I come out with a whole bag of belonging so I'll do a little haul in the car for you guys I went to CVS and I came because I needed shaving cream so where's the shaving cream I ran out and I got this uh, shaving foaming shave gel from this brand called Flamingo has anyone ever heard of this brand I never have but I thought it looked nice. It's made with aloe vera, so yeah, I just needed shaving cream. And then I also needed a new outlet for under my desk because there's like so many plugs down there. I only have one outlet and I have like five things I need to have plugged in. So instead of an extension cord, I wanted to get one of these like plug in wall things. Also needed some new hair ties because you know as hair ties go we have so many of them and they just somehow disappear one by one mysteriously so I literally have like three hair ties left so I picked up these and these I really liked because of the material of it it's not like your average like scrunchy this one is like kind of a felt material sorry I don't know how to turn off the notifications on my iPhone uh, iWatch like, I don't know how to put it on silent. Can someone write in the comments how to put an Apple Watch on silent? Because I've never known how to do it. And every time I get, like, texts or any type of notification, it always, like, dings on my phone. And I don't know how to turn it off. So if you guys know how to turn the sound off on here, please let me know. Okay, and then I also ran out of hyaluronic acid. So I picked this one up from La Roche-Posay. I am seriously loving this skincare brand it is pricey but it is dermatologist recommended so um i'm starting to lean more a lot towards like drugstore makeup um skincare products like la roche posay i also picked up something from sarah v which is another brand i am a fan of this is the skin renewing retinol serum and i am running low on my retinol i have just one left from i'm using the use to the people one and that one is pretty much like almost done because I go through retinol really quick. I picked up a couple makeup products. I've always been a huge fan of Physicians Formula. This was like my favorite makeup brand in high school and their butter bronzers are the best. I haven't had a butter bronzer in so long so I picked up one of them. I am running through bronzers quickly in the summertime because I want to look extra bronzed in the summer. I picked up one from Dior from Sephora which I like that one but I just really love for an everyday foundation or everyday um, bronzer 
um, like a drugstore one. So the Physician's Formula one. Oh my god, this brings me back. This just brings back so many good memories of when I first started wearing makeup. Out of all the like dozens of bronzers I've used over the years, Physician's Formula has always been like one of my favorites. So, and I love the packaging. How cute is that for summertime? I don't know if it's picking it up because it's like really bright. Um, but it comes with the brush underneath as well. I never use that brush, but it's kind of nice that it comes with that. Oh, this brush is different. It's like a little like felt pad. In the past, it's actually been a actual flat brush, but oh well. Um, and then I also picked up something from NYX, another makeup drugstore um, makeup line I really like. This is the Lingerie Double XL. Is that how you say it? The XXL lip, um, like lip gloss, lipstick. And this is in the color Turn On. And this color is seriously like so gorgeous. Sorry if it's so bright, I cannot tell. Um, but yeah, that's like my perfect type of shade. Okay, and then I picked up another sunscreen. I just needed another one, SPF 50. I have been running through sunscreens a lot because even though I don't go to the pool, like I'll still wear sunblock every single day when I leave my house. Even when I'm running errands like today, I'll wear sunscreen on my face and my body just because I'm like so anal about protecting my skin so the last thing i got is um some supplements these are oil of oregano so onto and i talked to um this person uh one of like a like a family friend the other day and she's very big on like herbal supplements and uh holistic health so she gave us a lot of advice for like um, things we can do to like kind of like clear like all of like the uh, pathogens from her body which are like things that like kind of leach onto your tissues i'm not an expert like she was really explaining so good all these different things but basically um she gave us some like health tips things we're gonna try to um kind of heal naturally our bodies so a couple of things she mentioned are um drinking celery juice i'm gonna start drinking celery juice every morning we both are drinking lemon water every day which i pretty much do already um and also um, a lot of thyme and oregano is really good for you so like drinking oregano tea thyme tea and so i saw these supplements today and i wanted to try them out so let me know in the comments if you are like big on holistic health and if you have any other tips for us because we're, we're really starting to get into that kind of stuff and i'm just really excited to like you know make my body feel better naturally with um natural herbs and um you know just stuff like that so that's all i got i'm gonna go get a car wash right now i think it's gonna rain actually but uh i parked on, in a garage so it's fine but my car is so dirty there's poop everywhere bird poop so i'm gonna do a car wash and then we will head home it is hot today i definitely need to go to the pool at least for like an hour thank you enjoy your day you too One thing about glasses I hate is having to switch between sunglasses and regular glasses when you go into like a dark area. Jeez, my phone. Every time I come to the car wash, I feel like it's such a fun event. I love getting my car washed. I love taking care of my car. I didn't go to Dunkin', which is always my ritual before um, going to the car wash, but I already had two coffees today. I was like, I cannot have any more. So I was craving a chicken Caesar wrap for lunch. So I went to the grocery store on my way home to go pick up the ingredients. So I got some Caesar croutons. I got some wraps. These protein plant powered low carb wraps. I also got just a bunch of random stuff. I'm not gonna do a full haul because a lot of this is kind of boring, but I got like eggs. I wanna make some cookies today. I got the pecan turtle delight and just plain chocolate chip. Um, I got a bunch of fruit, I got some hummus, celery for celery juice, organic. I got some zero sugar Chobani yogurt, and then just a bunch of fruits and vegetables. I got pears, bananas, cucumbers, strawberries. Where's all my Caesar wrap stuff? There's the Caesar dressing, and I picked up another Starbucks coffee, orange juice, my favorite bagel thins i love those for breakfast and oh my gosh wait where are my avocados oh i got avocados too i haven't had avocado toast in forever oh and the other thing for the caesar wraps i already have lettuce and i have the breaded chicken i'm gonna use i'm gonna just pop one of these in the air fryer and slice it up and just throw me together a little caesar chicken wrap
so I know normally people will wrap this up and put it on the stove to kind of like give it a little like grill press but I'm gonna just eat it plain mainly because the tortilla I got is a little bit too small to like roll up completely and I kind of overstuffed it so I'm gonna just eat this like a taco pretty much but yeah there it is I just mixed some romaine with the um, croutons I put some Parmesan cheese I forgot to get shredded Parmesan so I just used grated Parmesan I mean same thing and then I put Caesar dressing and croutons my chicken is underneath there, I air fried it, and I'm gonna just chomp on this pretty much since I can't really close it up. Own appetite. Oh my God, look at that. Can you see? It's so much, I really overstuffed it. Mmm. So, so good. This is my pool OOTD. I just got this set from Shein. I really love it. I was actually going to return it because I thought it was too small because you guys know I like my oversized things, but I think it looks pretty good. It's a size large. It just came with the shorts and the white button up top. And my swimsuit is a one piece. This is from H&M. No, this is from Boohoo like a few years ago. It was kind of, yeah, kind of a while ago I got it. Um, I don't know if they still sell it. If they do, I'll link it. But I'll definitely link the set because I just got this. And I know it's still available. But yeah, um, it's kind of cloudy. And I don't know if it's going to rain. I checked the weather. And it said it's not going to rain. It's just cloudy. So I'm praying for the best. I'm just going to go for a little bit. Honestly, even if I go for just like an hour, that's totally fine. Um, but I just missed the pool. And I wanted to break out my new set. So yeah, I will link this in my description. Sorry, it's so dark. I'm currently in my office. I'm actually editing this vlog that you're currently watching. Look at this inception. Yeah, so um, I didn't spend much time at the pool. It literally started raining probably 30 minutes after I got down there, but at least I got to go outside and get some fresh air, so that was nice. But yeah, I came back and I just started editing. Um, I wanted to do some work now because my friends were coming over tonight. We're gonna just hang out and chill, and I think a couple of them are gonna sleep over. And I think I'm gonna go to the gym with one of them. So yeah, it's gonna be a chill rest of the night. I think we're gonna get like some sushi um, and just hang out. So it'll be a fun night, but that's the update on my day. And it's so dark outside. It's only 6.30. Usually at this time, like the sun is shining so bright. But the lightning storms have been really, really scary uh, in this area. And it gets just super dark so early now when that happens. Okay, so we just worked out and we decided not to order out. So I'm cooking dinner for everyone. I'm making some grilled chicken and grilled vegetables. And oh my God, sorry, the lens is fogging up because I'm literally cooking over the stove. So. Yeah, I'm making some grilled chicken, grilled zucchini. I'm roasting some potatoes in the air fryer and we have rice that is all cooked. We just got back from the gym, so we're gonna try to have a healthy dinner. Who wants liquid IV? Wait, I wanna see this. This is like a store. I, got, I feel like a dealer. <laughs> Who wants the good so much yes. spot? I Everyone help this. yourself. Never Even though I have a lot of green tea at home. <laughs> yes.